Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And today's video is who I want to win in the play-in round predictions. Obviously, I did my predictions for the play-in round, but that doesn't mean whoever I picked, I don't want to win. You know, for example, I mean, you'll see later on, but there are some teams that I want to win, but when I predicted them, I don't think they're going to win. So, you know... Right now, recording this, there's 11 more hours until the first game, which is the Rangers and Hurricanes. They're the first game, and I am so pumped. I literally can't sleep. It's 11 more hours left, but I didn't post a video today. I've been busy. So here we go. You know, I'm not making wrestling videos anymore because I don't watch wrestling. Once the sports are back on, it's sports first and then wrestling. I don't even, my PVR is not working, so I can't even PVR, SmackDown, Raw, or AEW. So I just don't make videos anymore, but I heard this SmackDown was good. Go figure, the one SmackDown I don't watch is the good SmackDown, but there will be like a repeat like two days from now, but I'll watch the repeat. So anyways, so here we go. So it's the exact same screen as last time. Leafs versus Columbus. In my playing round prediction, I predicted the Leafs to win. But that doesn't mean I want the Leafs to win. In fact, I want Columbus to win. So, you know, this is pretty much the, the video. I predicted the Leafs to win, but I want Columbus to win. So this is my want. I want Columbus to win, but I predicted the Leafs. Next round, Habs versus Penguins. I predicted the Penguins to win. But I want the Habs to win. You know, obviously I'm a Bruins fan. I don't like either team. Obviously I should, you know, I should hate Montreal more than Pittsburgh. But to be honest, it's the opposite because Montreal isn't that good right now, right? So there's no rival between Boston and Montreal because Montreal is not that good. But Pittsburgh is a good team. And Pittsburgh always beats Boston or, you know, the other way. And I'm tired of seeing Pittsburgh win. You know, they won back-to-back -back Stanley Cups a couple of years ago. And their fan base is, you know, when they win a game, they think they won the Cup. It's like the Leafs, right? Actually, let's go back to that. So, obviously, I want Columbus to win because the Leafs, in my opinion, have the most toxic fan base. And you guys will see that in an upcoming video. I will tell, I'll be giving you one reason why they're the most toxic fans in the NHL. Same thing, you know. I remember they beat they beat Montreal. Okay, guys, they beat Montreal in an exhibition game. They beat Montreal in an exhibition game. I think it was four two, and all their comments on Instagram were saying twenty twenty Stanley Cup champions. Oh, we're winning the the cup this year. First of all, it's Montreal. They're not a playoff team. They fin they finished twelfth place. They barely got in. And second of all, it's an exhibition game. Calm down. Holy. I hate Toronto. I literally hate Toronto. You know, I like the I like some of the players on the team. It's just the fan base that makes me hate the Leafs. You know, Columbus is literally the opposite. I haven't even met one Columbus fan yet. All my friends, they're not Columbus fans. And they've been through so many injuries this year. And in my opinion, they have one of the most underrated coaches in the NHL in John Tortorella. Uh, I think that, that's how you pronounce his last name. I don't know. But their whole team's been injured this season. And it'd be amazing if Columbus won, in my opinion. I do not want the Leafs to win. Their fan base is so toxic. And trust me, if the Leafs lose this round, I have a feeling they're going to get Lafinier. I, I don't know why. If the Leafs get Lafinier, I will not watch the NHL. Until he retires. Alright. But I mean, that's just my little rant. So that's why I do not want Toronto or Pittsburgh winning. In my opinion, Toronto is the most toxic fan base in the NHL. And I want to see... And for this series now, I want to see Salty Pants fans. You know, saying, oh, why do we have to play Montreal? That's, you know, that's bullshit. But that, that's why it's going to be hilarious. <laughs> Obviously, I think the Pants are just going to sweep Montreal. You know, after seeing the Leafs versus the Habs in that exhibition game, 
Carey Price was so out of it. Holy. He allowed so many rebounds right to the Toronto team. And then they just scored off their own rebound. And Carey Price did not even try. He didn't even make an attempt to save it. He's just there to collect a check, in my opinion. He's making, what, 10 mil a season? Jeez, man. After seeing that performance, I don't even think he's worth 3 million. But, anyways. Islanders and Panthers. Now, two teams I do not care about. In my opinion, this is the second most boringest series. My prediction was the Islanders, and who I want to win is the Islanders. I don't really care who wins this. In my opinion, if the Panthers win, I don't really care. If the Islanders win, I don't care. I just like Matthew Brazell, and we we, we could have drafted him, but we drafted Jake DeBrusk instead. So they'll always forever haunt me. You know, we could literally have Matt Brazell instead of Jake DeBrusk. And we're going to trade Jake DeBrus for cap space to re-sign Tory Krug. And I don't even like Jake DeBrus, to be honest. He just had a knee-on-knee hit against Kadri, and that was his five seconds of fame. But this is not about him. So, yeah, Islanders, I want them to win. I don't really care about this uh, thing. Anyways, Rangers versus Hurricanes. In my prediction, I predicted the Rangers to win, and who I want to win is the Rangers. My third favorite team in the NHL is the Rangers. I have, I only have one favorite team. I should actually say this. I only like the Bruins. But I like some players on other teams, which makes me like them. So if I were to cheer for a team, I'd want the Rangers. You know, I'm a huge Panarin fan. I, I just like the Rangers. You know, they decided to rebuild last season or two seasons ago, just out of nowhere. And for them to be in a, well, not technically a playoff spot, but they are. I just want them to win. I want to see their success r rise more. And Carolina, whenever they win, that whole Carolina celebration thing is so cringe. Just please stop. Please stop. Don't do it. Don't do it in this playoff. So I want the Rangers to win, and I predicted them. So let's move on to the West. Winnipeg and Calgary. I predicted Winnipeg to win. Who I want to win is Calgary. My second team is Calgary. You know, I'm a huge Kachuk fan. I'm a huge Johnny Hockey fan. Huge Monaghan fan. I really like their, you know, play style, I guess. And to be honest, they're my favorite Canadian team in the NHL. Calgary is my favorite Canadian team by far in the NHL. You know, I want... I want uh, Flames to win, but I won't be mad if the Jets win that. I like both, you know. The whiteout effect's sick, obviously. We won't be getting that. But, yeah. Anyways. Oilers and Hawks. Here we go. <laughs> so my prediction, I predicted the Oilers to win in five. Okay? Who I want to win? It's going to sound crazy because I'm a Bruins fan. But I want the Hawks to win. The same thing with Edmonton, their fan base. You know... They brag that, oh, we have Dreisaitl, we have McDavid, you know. They're all happy. And how funny would it be if the Hawks beat the Oilers? Holy, their fan base would go absolutely nuts, man. I want the Hawks to win this so bad. This is the best, the best series, in my opinion. Oilers and Hawks are the best series in the playing round. And then it's the Habs and the Pants. And then it's the Jets and the Flames. And then it's the Leafs. But I want the Hawks to win. It sounds crazy, but I want them to win. Even as a Bruins fan, I want the Hawks to win. It's I don't know. It sounds weird. But anyways, Vancouver versus Minnesota. I predicted Vancouver. But after seeing you know Minnesota play that exhibition game against... Uh, Avalanche, they looked amazing. And they left off how the... They pretty much left off how the season finished. They were red hot. And they just continued it into the Avalanche. And now looking back at it, I think Minnesota's going to win the series. I can't change my prediction. My prediction is still Vancouver in four, I think I put. I, I forget how many games. But you guys could look at that video. But seeing how Minnesota played... Holy, they looked amazing. They were all over the Avs. I think the Avs won that game. 
I watched two periods, the first and the second. And Minnesota looks so good. But anyways, this is not about <laughs> exhibition games. I predicted Vancouver to win. I want Vancouver to win. I'm a really big Brock Besser fan. I actually really like a lot of players on Vancouver. I like Brock Besser. I like Pedersen. I like Tyler Toffoli. I like Markstrom, to be honest. I like Quinn Hughes. I, I really like this team, how they're uh, shaping out. But I won't be mad if Minnesota wins, you know. If anything... I'll be happy whoever wins this because Minnesota is red hot right now. I won't be surprised if they win. I just want Vancouver to win. I, I like some more players than on Minnesota. And I'm pretty sure this is the second last. Sorry, this is the last. Yeah, this is the last. Um, This is, in my opinion, the most boring series in all of them. Nashville versus Arizona. I predicted Nashville. My want is Arizona. I don't like any of these teams. But am I I don't know why. I just feel like Nashville's a washed up team. I don't I don't know why. I just don't like Nashville. I like them when they uh beat Chicago when they were the eighth seed. When Nashville was the eighth seed and they swept Chicago and they made it pretty far. And then the next year, they went to the Stanley Cup Finals against Pittsburgh. That's when I liked them. But this season, I just don't care about Nashville. I don't know why. I just have no interest in Nashville anymore. So that's why I want Arizona to win. That's literally why I want Arizona to win. But, you know, I thought I'd make that little fun video. I was sitting today, and I realized I have no video today. And I'm like, well, why not make this little fun video? It's going to release really late for me. Right now, 11 hours and 30 more minutes until the first puck drop, which is this game. So Rangers and Hurricanes play at 12. 3 o'clock is this game. 4 o'clock is this game. 8 o'clock is that game. And 10.30 is this game. What a Saturday night card, to be honest. I'm really pumped for this game. Or, or no, sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. This game. At thir wow. Wow. This Saturday night card is amazing. I am not leaving my coach all day. But, you know, other than that, subscribe, guys. You know, I'm really trying to grow out this channel. I'll be posting hockey a lot. Obviously, I watch hockey the most, as you could tell. And then baseball. I haven't even posted a basketball or NFL video yet. But that'll come later on. But other than that, subscribe, guys. We're at 17 subscribers. In the first month now, I, I started this YouTube channel July 1st. Now today's August 1st when this video releases. 17 subscribers in the first month is really good you know obviously when you first start off a youtube channel it starting off is the longest uh part of youtube i think you know starting off because no one knows your channel and then once that one video blows up you, you get the point but 17 subs in the first month is really good i was expecting like 10 but well, thank you guys you know subscribe helps me a lot like the videos you guys are killing it Turn on the bell icon, I'll notify me. And comment down below. We need more. We need more comments down below. Come on, guys. I want to interact with you guys. But other than that, I'll see you guys in my next video. I don't know when that will be anymore because I don't have any more pre-recorded videos. So watch hockey tomorrow, guys. Hockey's on all day long. I can't live stream until I hit 1,000 subs. I would love to live stream. I want to live stream on my phone. I could live stream on my computer, but I don't really want to. But, guys, watch hockey all day tomorrow. That's what I'll be doing. And peace.